For about a quarter of a century, the sport of choice among students at County Central High in Falcon has been rugby. We've had valedictorians play for us. We've had the kids that have been bean poles and six foot four play. We've had the kids that don't have much physical fitness and we find a spot for them that we can get them on the field and play them. At a school where nearly a third of all students play rugby, it comes as no surprise that the biggest trip in school history would be to the home of the game, New Zealand. Well, you know, even though it's sometimes an overused statement, it is a, a trip of a lifetime for some of these kids. They may never ever get out to New Zealand or wherever you might go on a tour like this. So this is huge to them. Uh, they're seeing another culture. They're getting to play games in the number one, to me, the number one country in the world, New Zealand, for, for rugby. What you want to do is you want to go low, keep your feet moving. Angie Seaman is co-coach and the school's phys ed teacher. You want to run through contact. She says excitement among players for the two-week trip in April is growing daily. Oh, I'd say so. Yeah, they are definitely getting excited. Miss Seaman, what are we going to do this and where are we going to do that and what should I pack? And I get questions probably every day about New Zealand. <laughs> The school has been granted special permission to start practicing ahead of schedule to prepare for the four games we're playing in New Zealand. With the regular field covered with snow, they've had to move practice indoors, which hasn't exactly slowed them down. In all 50 players, five staff members and 10 parent chaperones will be making the trip. They've all got their own ideas about what it's going to be like. I'm really excited, but I'm kind of nervous because I don't know, like they, I don't know, they're probably going to be really good because like that's where like rugby kind of started. Playing of the game is definitely going to be a fun aspect, but I think going to see their culture and how things work down there is going to be pretty interesting. The opportunities that the education system offers to our kids now is is just mind-boggling and yeah, I think they'll become better athletes, better people even, just because they've got to experience other cultures and, and other ways of life. One of the parents knows exactly what to expect. She's from New Zealand. Um, they're going to enjoy the beauty of, the beauty of the country and the people themselves, the New Zealanders, and the, they're going to experience like not only the rugby side of things, uh, it's the national sport of New Zealand, but they're also going to have the cultural experience, um, geothermal, the Maori culture. So they're going to be totally immersed in that. So it's going to be a great experience, lifetime experience. 